Hey y'all, here's what's poppin' in this video. She's crazy. I mean, look at my name. Ever heard of Karen Crazy? That's me. Puts a Bible on her to wake her up. Dies again. Don't be trying to steal my patient. Get away from me. Girl, I'm gonna follow you. I'm like such a nice person. <laughs> <sighs> hey guys, welcome back. It's Karen Crazy. Karen Crazy came back. And I'm going to be a nurse, I guess, because these sickos need help. So I'm just going to go ahead and walk in here and just be me, aka the boss. Like, they should promote me, even though they haven't even gotten to know me yet. They should just let me be the manager because I will run this place. Period. Um, hi guys. Hello. Karen Crazy is here. And I'm the best nurse in here. Like, don't play, period. We don't care, okay? And I didn't ask you to care. <laughs> like, don't be mad. Like, I don't care. Y'all are so, so, so jealous. Like, you're jealous, you're jealous, you're jealous. <laughs> Who needs help? Because me, Karen Crazy, AKA the best nurse. Stop the cow. It's gonna help me. So what seems to be the problem? Like, is do you have a headache or you just feeling sick or you're having a baby or like what what what's up? Like, you gotta tell me. I pooped out of my mouth. Oh my god. Oh, hell. Okay, come with me. Even though that's disgusting and weird. Um, just come with me. So would you like a hospital bed or do you wanna walk? Okay, we got you. She said yes. So we're gonna go ahead and go to, to take this sicko to a hospital bed. Um, we're gonna place you right here. How is the poop in your mouth making you feel? Like, what's going on? Depressed, oh. So the poop in her mouth is making her depressed. Okay, gotcha. Is it still in there or? No, let me get some water. Water, water for, for myself, myself, by, by the way. way. <clears throat> Anyways, and uh-uh, what are all these people doing in my room? So is the poop in your mouth making it swell? Dies, oh, she just died. Puts a Bible on her to wake her up. Dies again. We need to take you to the emergency room cause I don't know what's going on with you. You definitely need to go to the emergency room. Like, like I, I even know, know where, where it is. is. Um, okay ma'am, please calm down. Everything will be okay. We just need to give you some medicine. Let me take your blood pressure because you seem sick. You need CPR, does 30 chest compressions, gives two breaths of air. You should be good to go, ma'am. Cause I don't know, um, farts in face. Yeah, I'm done with this kid. She's too disgusting. Like this job is so hard. Like I'm probably the most hardworking nurse. <laughs> um, ma'am, ma'am, do you need help? Oh yes, follow me. Um, let's go to this one because those two are occupied. Have a lay. So what seems to be the problem exactly? Because apparently you are sick. I mean, look at your face. <laughs> um, sorry, not sorry. Um, I broke a few bones and the doctor said I need surgery. Let's take you to the exam room. Okay, so I just changed to get my uniform. Okay, so just breathe and everything will be okay. I'm, I'm a nurse, nurse, but I've been a surgeon, surgeon for 40, 40 years, years, so, so I, I know what I'm doing. doing. Let me put her the sleeping gas on. I'm gonna replace her leg. And fix the leg bones. And then what we need is, I'm gonna um, get another shot and put it in her just in case she wake up during the, the surgery. Boop. We have to cut your arm so that we can um, fix the bones in there. And now we have to stitch it back. Okay, ma'am, we're all done. We're all good to go. That only hurt a little. Yeah, you'll be sore for a couple of months, but it'll heal. 
I can walk. Oh, good job. I'm good. Thank you so much for coming at Maple Hospital. Um, I hope you're doing well, I guess. Can't, Can't believe I'm being, being nice. nice. Like, W doctor or W nurse. Like, these surgeons don't know how to do their job. And I'm literally the only one who is doing, actually doing something. I know. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Am I the best doctor or the only doctor? Like, because isn't nobody doing their job? And now we have to find another sick patient meeting. Oh, it's a meeting? Uh, whatever. So what's the meeting for? Do I need doctors to stay at the front desk? Because if you all go help them, then there will be no staff. Mm, let them know. Let me raise my hand. I'm raising my hand. Hello. Um, so when is the paycheck coming? Cause that's really all I came here for tonight. Okay. Leave if you don't have a question. Where is all the patients? Where did they go? Passes out. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Let me take you to the ER room. What's going on? What seems to be the problem with you? I got stabbed in the back and head. Oh my gosh. Are you still bleeding? It should be gone, but are you still bleeding? Yes. Wow. I don't know what to tell you. Bye. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. First, we need a washcloth to wipe the blood. So let me wipe, wipe, wipe. And then let's wrap it around with a bandage. The head isn't in too deep. And let me just put the bandage on. Well, did it go through your spine? I don't know. I, can, I can't I can see. Well, does it feel like it went through your spine? If it does, we can take you to the x-ray room and we can check it out. It felt kind of near my heart. Mm. Well, we need to take you to the x-ray room. We need to take you to the x-ray room and then we can check it out. Because I don't know what that is but you'll be fine just don't panic don't worry i don't even know if i'm going the right way oh they have an elevator in here i did not know that here's the x-ray room activate x-ray machine oh she done went through the thing okay so we did the x-ray machine it looks like your spine has been shattered so we need to do surgery to repair it passes out oh my gosh we need to go to the emergency room. Huh, how many times have I done surgery today? Like, oh my gosh. Let me give her anesthesia by telling her you're not a surgeon. Trust me, I've been a surgeon for 70, 70 years. years. I know what I'm doing, so you can stop the attitude, miss ma'am. Anyways, like I'm literally trying to help you. I, I could literally just leave you here. Ugh. Kids these days thinking they're so smart moves around too much. Let me force you down since you want to move so much. Anyways, cut spine. You need some holy water. You need some Jesus. Um, don't try and steal my patient. Don't steal my patient. What? What? Don't try and steal my patient. No, we are not done. Don't be trying to steal my patient. Now she's flopping her way where. I'm so sorry about that, ma'am. I don't know what that freak tried to do. Anyways. Let me stitch your back together. Let me stitch your back. Loses blood. Let me pump some blood in you. Starts dying. Girl, I don't even know what to do right now. Ma'am, are you okay? Please respond. Why she, why she over here talking about some, mm, I don't know what that language is. Mm, what, what is she, what is going on? Tries to tell them, tries to, trying to tell them, pull them out. Oh, I didn't even see the knife there. Oh, she just walked away. So ma'am, how are you feeling now? Like, is everything okay? Mm, oh, let me take it off of the mouth. Something was wrapped around her mouth. I'm fine. Okay, so do you need more assistance or are you good to go? I'm hungry. Um, I don't know what food is there. Let me feed, feed you some breast milk. Oh God. Oh, hell. <laughs> that help. She's crazy. I mean, look at my name. Ever heard of Karen Crazy? That's me. She tried to feed me like I was a baby. She's about to snitch on me to my boss. Like, you're such an op. Oh my gosh. Should I just run or defend myself? Like, you should be grateful. You should be grateful that I, I I fed you at least something. Like you could have fed yourself some of your own booby milk, but no. 
I might just sue this. You should be suing your books and your studies. You're crazy, I'm suing. Let me smack you with this mop. Smacks with a mop. I'm about to mop, mop your ass. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, mm-hmm. Karen, do your job, girly. Yes, this is my job. Kayla, I was, Kayla, I was your friend. Ooh, ooh. I'm unfriending you. Ooh, she finna unfriend you. I mean, <clears throat> she's about to unfriend you. What a crybaby. Ooh, records. I don't care. I literally just caused a friendship breakup. <laughs> I'm so, 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 so evil. Who was more evil than Karen Crazy? I have way more friends than just you. Mm. See, me personally, I, I, I would have taken that level of disrespect, but that's just me though. Get away from me. Girl, I'm gonna follow you. Like, don't tell me to get away. I'm like such a nice person. Don't talk to me like that. Like, girl, stop. Girl, go. I can't even tell if she's role playing or not. <laughs> like, let me try and find her. There was literally pink nurse scrubs. Like, I literally could have worn this. This would have been a fit. I literally could have, like, just worn this. Like, you know what? I will be back. Karen Crazy will be back. I'm gonna be something better. I, Karen Crazy, am the best and hard working nurse anybody can ever have or be in Maple Hospital. See y'all sickos later, I guess.